Hello everyone, this is David A. Cox with PCClassesOnline.com and today I'm going to be teaching all of you how you can add a graphical signature to all of your outgoing email messages. Now today I'm going to show you how to do this both in Windows in Thunderbird as well as on the Mac using Apple Mail. Now before we get started here, it should be noted not everyone out there is a master at Photoshop. I myself know enough to get by, but not all of us have that sense of design, which is really critical when creating good graphics. So what I'm going to do is show you, if you do not know how to design your own graphic, a great resource to have someone else do it for you at a very low cost. There's this wonderful little website called Fiverr. Fiverr.com is where you can pay people $5 to do a million different things for you. And this just happens to be one of the best things that you can get with Fiverr. So just go to the little search bar at the top right of Fiverr and type in the words email signature. You'll find here quite a few people who are all very qualified for creating graphics. I discovered this one uh, while just kind of browsing around and I found some really impressive images here. Like this one right here for a realtor looks awesome. It's $5 you usually take a couple days of going back and forth with the person just giving them the information and just refining the look of the graphic but it's really easy to use and it's very inexpensive of course so once you have that graphic you are going to receive it as either a JPEG file or a PNG file either works fine don't worry about it now from here I'm going to use an example that I pulled just off of Google images it's a fake contact info so just double click on that image to open it up and this part you can do either in Windows or Mac. From here you're going to copy the image by going to edit and click copy. Now let's go over how to do this on the Mac side. Go into Apple Mail, click where it says mail at the top left of your screen and go into preferences which is the second item down. From here you have several tabs at the top click over here on the right hand side on signatures and click on the little plus symbol that you see here in the middle. You can name your signature whatever you want. I'm just going to call it graphic. And now any text that you see here in this box you can just delete. So just select it and delete it. From here it works the exact same way that a Word document works. So you're going to hit command and the letter V as in Victor to paste it. Now, there's only a couple more steps. You need to take this right here where it says graphic or however you name it and drag it into your email address right here. Now, click on that email address. Go down here to the bottom where it says choose signature and you want that to be the default option. And of course, make sure this box here is checked. So now when I close this out and I create a new message, you will see that my graphic signature is now automatically added to the bottom of every outgoing email. Now let's go over how to do that in Windows. As I said, the process itself, let's get out of that, of getting the image, of course, it just goes to the web, go to fiverr.com and uh, pay them $5 for a custom design. And when you have your image, double click on it, copy it, and now in Thunderbird, here's the final steps. Go up here to where it says Tools at the very top and go down to Account Settings. On the very first tab, which should be your email address, and don't bother emailing that address, it's purely used for demonstration purposes. Down here you will see Attached Signature from a File instead. You're going to check that box, hit Choose, and just simply point it to that particular graphic. That's all everyone. I hope you enjoyed this little video. If you happen to be watching us right now on YouTube, if you want to give us a little bit of support, a little bit of love, you can click on that little like button uh, at the bottom of the video. And if you haven't done so, make sure you check out our website. We're a completely free online service. We offer live and pre-recorded classes and we have members in over 160 countries. This is David A. Cox with PC Classes Online. You all have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.